Now, have you ever wondered what it would be like to work in a newsroom like the one here at the BBC? Well, hundreds of 12 and 13 year olds have swapped their usual lessons for classes in news. Schools across the UK have been working with BBC journalists, learning about what it takes to put a bulletin together. And in just under an hour's time, they'll go live with their reports. Well, Alex Bushell is at Coombs Head College in Newton Abbott. Alex. Well, yes, it's just under an hour to go before around 100 schools up and down the country will go live with their very own school report. So it's a question now of keeping your wits about you, keeping calm. Just time for me to say lights, camera, action, and hand you over to our presenters, Jake and Beth. Hello, and welcome to the news from Coombs Head College. Every good newsroom has a meeting, and here at Coombs Head, it's no different. We have our own editors, Tom and Summer. We have our chief sub-editor, Kenny, and we have lots of reporters, and we even have our own camera crew. And there's lots of discussion. We're going to put our reports on our school TV. On the radio. This is Radio Coombs Head. And on the web, so there's lots to do. There's filming. One of our reports is about becoming an eco-school. Well, I do hope we become an eco-school. We chose to do that because we were worried about the environment. There's editing. Rehearsing, too. And like every journalist, we have tight deadlines to work to as well. Huge studio. We aren't the only school taking part. More than 100 other schools are, too. Surveillance of teams has increased over the past... Fort Hill School in Basingstoke made this film about why big groups of young people aren't allowed in shops. And Brentside High School in Ealing interviewed the director of Happy Feet. Can you like give us a bit of a clue on an exclusive? Um, oh, you're a good journalist. Uh. <laughs> school report is all about learning about the news. It helps us with English and citizenship lessons. Plus, we get better at working in the team and communicating with each other. I think it's like really, really good. It's like really good fun, and it's a great experience. I've learnt lots about writing and how to make the news work. I think it's actually very interesting for people who want to be journalists and um, people who want to be presenters in um, years to come. I think it's a very good experience for them. It's been fun and a great experience. And although it's been hectic, I can't wait to do it again. Well, if you think this is child's play, and think again. This is a state-of-the-art studio. And I have to say, having spent all morning here, Sophie, you and I might be out of a job in a few years' time. <laughs> Alex, thank you very much. They're brilliant, aren't they? So confident. 